Here's what I love about the Paula Deen Corn Bake. It has simple ingredients, it's easy to make, and it's oh so delicious. Alright, so let's take a look at our ingredients. We got a can of creamed corn. We got a box of corn muffin mix. We got some frozen whole kernel corn. I like to use the frozen stuff instead of canned. Uh, we have a bag of shredded cheese and we have a half a stick of butter that's going to be melted and we need one cup of sour cream. Pretty much dirt simple. Alright, let's start the preparation here. We'll begin by preheating the oven to 350 degrees. Now in a mixing bowl, add the cream corn, the whole corn, the sour cream, and the melted butter. Mix it together until all the ingredients are well coated. Now go ahead and add the box of corn muffin mix. Now you're going to have to blend the mixture well until it's nice and consistent. I like to use a fork here uh, instead of, say, like an electric blender. Alright, lightly grease a 9x13 baking dish and add your corn mixture. Spread it out evenly. Okay, let's take a moment to breathe here. You know, so far we haven't done much that's really fancy. I mean, this is not rocket science, people. Nor are we asking you to create some kind of pan-seared scallops. Okay, so now we're going to get to the baking part. So go ahead and put your dish in the preheated oven and set your timer for 40 minutes. Alright, so go ahead and cue up the elevator music, and then after 40 minutes, we can take this uh, dish out of the oven, and you should see a nice golden brown look to it. Uh, then we're going to top it with the cheese and put it back in the oven for five more minutes. Alright, then finally, let's do the finishing touches here. We're going to take it out of the oven, we're going to top it with a little bit of ground pepper. And then I like to add a few chopped scallions just for a nice kind of look. And then we're going to allow it to cool for five minutes, and then we serve it up warm. Okay, I'm going to take a second here and just uh, issue a little bit of a diet alert. Um, if you're on one of these diets and you're wondering whether or not this uh, dish fits into your diet, well, let me help you out. Do not pass go, do not collect 200, lose on the slot machines, and go ahead and roll some snake eyes. I'm sure this recipe just violates about 100 rules of any of these given diets. So the simple answer is no. So there you have it, the Paula Dean Corn Bake as made by Chef Man Cave. So just remember, cook well, eat well, and live well.